we're going to be checking out the top 50 most awkward texts sent between families. If I ever sent one of these texts to one of my parents, I think I would get grounded for a very, very long time. And the last one is the worst by far. Enjoy. All right, so our first text is to dad here. Dad, I decided to leave school. Okay then, but there's one thing you must never forget, son. What is it? You've got to smile while delivering pizza. Wait, wow, that is brutal. Imagine what my parents said when I told them I wanted to be a full-time YouTuber. No, honestly, they were actually super supportive, but I know I'm very lucky. Mom, why have you blacklisted my number? I had to because of all that spam. Dude, blacklisted? That's pretty intense. What spam? Things like, mom, put some money on my phone. Mom, I need a new jacket. And mom, I need some cash pronto. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. These parents do not play around. She literally blacklisted her son's number. Dad, can you give me $100? It's for mom's birthday present. If you were a dad, would you give your son or daughter $100 for a birthday present? I feel like $25 would be a good gift. What if the kid just pockets the money? I'll give you 50. Okay, there we go. There we go. It's not right that your present should be more expensive than mine. Honestly, that's fair. And you can still get some pretty good stuff for 50 bucks. That's like an aquarium ticket. I feel like a $50 gift, if you actually put like thought into it, could be a pretty cool gift. Oh gosh, this is the first one of mom. This is not going to be good. Mom, tell me the truth. Was I adopted? Do you think that given a choice, your dad and I would have picked someone like you? Dude, the kid didn't even respond because that was so bad. Also, we're going to put up a counter on screen because I feel like some of these are actually pretty, pretty realistic in my life. And I'm not going to lie, something like that similar very happened to me. I'm actually pretty interested to see how many of these actually apply to me. All right, so it looks like this is the son now. Dad, that old cell phone of yours that you gave me, dot, 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 yes. Oh gosh, this is not going to end well. Well, I was rummaging through it last night and... Oh, this, this cannot end well. This cannot end well. Mom sure looks cool in those photos. Oh crap. Oh crap is right, dad. That has definitely never happened to me before. I don't know if I could look at my parents the same after that. Mom, my room is not a mess. Everything in there is exactly where it needs to be. Really? What about the layer of dust on the table? Oh, wow. I've got important phone numbers written on it. Is that so? And what about the spider in the corner? Don't touch Kevin. He's done nothing to you. Hey, mom, I would not touch Kevin if I were you. But to be fair, I don't think I've ever named a spider in my room before. Dad. Oh my gosh. These dad ones are so funny. Dude, you should be here with us. Come get a breath of fresh country air. No way. You don't know what you're missing. We've got beer, barbecues, and girls that are ready to party. Dad, what? Dad won't buy it a second time. You and mom have to dig those potatoes without me, period. Not that exact scenario, but something like that has happened to me before. My dad tries to trick me into gardening on a very, very frequent basis. But instead of barbecues and girls, he tells me that there's good content in the backyard. Dad, son, you are in big trouble. Oh no, what did he do? Why? Because you're texting during lessons. Are you serious? It's you who started it. Wait, that is actually so smart. That one is 5,000 IQ. My parents have never done that to me before. Daughter, I need your help. Remind me one more time. How do I use the washing machine? It's a valid question. Select synthetics, set the temperature to 104, and pour some washing machine powder and turn it on. Thanks. What are the other modes for? They're for mom. And this is why we have a family group chat. Always text your questions to the family group chat because this might happen. Thankfully, this has never happened to me. Mom, where are you? Come back home this minute. Oh no, what did the kid do? What's the matter? Daughter, it's time you knew the truth. Your dad and I brought you into this world so you can wash our dishes? I mean, hey, at least the mom's being honest, right? But I guess there's also a world where that mom is definitely not joking. Dad, I won't be home tonight. Some girl's having a birthday party and it seems I was invited. Lucky you. How is that awkward? That one officially made no sense. Mom, dad wants to know how long you boil eggs for. Wait for me, you two. I'm coming. Mom, hurry up. One of those eggs has just exploded. Wait, what? I don't see these being awkward. These are just like bruh yeah. moments. Simon, dad, I crashed your car. That is a brutal text to send. What? Just kidding. I just failed biology class. Oh, okay. Honestly, that's, see, that's, that's smart. Oh, thank goodness for that. <laughs> I've actually heard of that mind trick before. You say something really bad to like compensate for the fact that you did another really bad thing. I don't think I've ever done that before. This is going to mom. Hooray, you finally entered the world of electronic communications. So how does it feel, mom? Do you like your new smartphone? 
Mom? She's not going to know how to text back. Are you there? Yeah. She, she, of course she doesn't know how to text back. Why don't you answer? How do you <laughs> use space? That hasn't happened with my mom, but that has happened a lot of times with my grandma. I also remember when my grandma first found out what emojis were. I was only getting texts in emojis and not in real words. Dad, Call of Duty, let's play. Dude, what a cool dad. What a cool dad. Dad, I'm at college. Oh, come on. I would drop college for Call of Duty. Let's go. Trader, my kid. Dad, when will you let me celebrate New Year's with my friends? When you find some. Mwahahaha. I'm not going to lie. That one kind of just made me cringe. Daddy, good morning, darling. How are you? I'm driving to work. We'll call you later. I love you, baby. Damn. Oh, uh, what? What? Oh, <laughs> Oh, oh, I thought that was meant to go to someone else. I, I literally stopped reading because I was so appalled. I've never gotten a text like that before. We just got a few more left to go. And the last couple are going to be the most awkward of the entire video. So try not to cringe. Andrew, hi, everyone. My folks are going to be away for two days. So you're welcome to come over. Let's have a house party. Bring your own food and drinks. Ask your pals. Oh my gosh. That is so awkward. That is so awkward. Hi, dad. I'm sorry. It looks like I accidentally added you to the group text. Okay. That one has got to be the worst by far. Your parents are leaving for the weekend. You try to throw a party and accidentally add them into the group chat. Oh wait, it literally keeps going. You've added your mother to that list as well, but I can still delete messages from her phone. You promised to tell your friends to buy me a bu- Wait, you're telling me the dad was okay with it? Mom, good morning, beautiful. Okay, that's not too awkward. XOXO, your imaginary boyfriend. What? Thanks, mom. Dot, 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 dot. That one spoke for itself. That was, that was just cringy. I feel like if my mom texted me that in the morning, I don't even know what I would do. That's just embarrassing. John. Dad. What is it, Sonny? Sonny? Who says Sonny? I've been throwing stones at our neighbor's Mercedes and smashed the windshield? I don't know you, young man. Who gave you this number? Kids, do not throw rocks at Mercedes and then tell your parents. That is just not right. Mom, please stop changing the Google logo so much. I like the original one. What? Mom, I can't change the logo. Google changes it. On my computer? You don't run the Google? If I did, I wouldn't be <laughs> driving a 2004 Ford. Why did the mom even think that he was running Google? <laughs> that one was so weird. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. These, these dad ones are definitely my favorite. I don't like taking you to college. It's so far away. Well, sorry, dad. You should have taken my advice and gone to Hogwarts for a year, gotten your license to fly, and then you could ride your broomstick to university. What? If only Harry Potter was real and you could really fly on a broomstick and get your flying license, that would be a very efficient way to travel. All right, the last and final one. Mom, can I bring my boyfriend to dinner tonight? Is he a nice young man? Yes, he is. He doesn't drink, doesn't smoke, and he's never rude. Sounds like a good guy to me. I don't know, sweetie. He sounds kind of boring. I feel like these just got more and more out of pocket as we went through them. What kind of mom would send that text? Well, guys, thank you so much for watching. We actually only got through 25 of the text messages today. So if you want to see the other 25 in this video, if we get 10,000 likes, I will do a part two. And don't forget to subscribe on the way out. Peace out, y'all.